nighttime baseball at Field of Dreams in Iowa. We expect a good one out of this Diamond Dynasty matchup between the Milwaukee Brewers and the Legends. It's going to be a premier pitching matchup. Two of the league's hardest throwers go head-to-head -head next. And stepping in, Colton Wong. And we are set for baseball here this Leading evening. Tonight for Milwaukee, the second baseman. Ready with the first Colton pitch. Here it comes. Wong. And now he'll try to bunt his way on to start the game. Throw to first is going to beat him, though, as they're able to thwart the bunt attempt. One out, base is empty. And that'll bring up Lorenzo Cain. First pitch on its way. Yeah. Game time temperature tonight 62 degrees but should drop into the 50s before we're done. Off I'm the sorry, plate the one ball one strike. This is skied into short left center. In comes the center fielder. He makes the running play two down. Base is that empty, is two away, the and right that'll bring up Abisayu Garcia. Garcia. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. Ball. Ball two. 2 0 to a guy with this kind of pop, you better be awfully careful because he's going to be swinging out of his shoes. And he has a cut at that two one, balls. but misses one two and one. What I love right there is just the freedom in that hack. He ain't trying to do anything but hit the baseball as far as he can. Even count two balls and two strikes. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. Next to bat will be the Cuban import, Yon Moncada. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The second baseman, Yoan. Long Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Now the 1 0. Pulled toward right center field. Kane is under it. One out. Now into the box, Batting Akil second. Badu. The center fielder, Akil Badu. First delivery to him. Oh, that's out. One out, nobody on. And that one misses upstairs, 2-0. Oh. Hey, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, that's right where you want to miss. Any lower, and he'll probably make you pay for it. The 2-1. Waves and misses for strike number two. You can really tell they're trying to keep the ball in on this big slugger right here. Is that an effort to keep him from getting extended, do you think? Yeah, I think that's the idea, Matt. But he might spin to win if he starts looking for it in there. Fouled off. A shot down the first baseline. Throw gets him, two down. Digging in will be Jose Ramirez. No one aboard for him, okay. and two gone here in the first. Ramirez. Now here it comes. Bases are empty here with two men out. Fouled away. And he fouls this one off. Here's the 0 and 2. Talk about frustrating as a pitcher. You make a great pitch like that, and the guy just lays off of it. That barely missed the zone. High in the air down the right field line. Garcia has a read on it, and the inning is over. New inning set to get underway, and next will be the switch hitting third baseman, Eduardo Escobar. Eduardo Escobar. Now here's the first offering. 
Nope. And that's okay. high for a ball, 1-0. Oh. That evens it up, 1-1. One and one. Now the pitch. Two balls, one strike, the count. Sent on the ground out to second. Moncada fields it cleanly. Throw is in time for the first out of the second. Next, it'll be Willie Adamas. The shortstop. Willie Adamas. Here's the first pitch to him. Sinker to open the A-B in there for strike one. Hit to first. And he'll step oh. on first for the out. Three unassisted. That is so good. now into the box the is you. Christian Yelich. He'll work on keeping Christian. this top of the second alive. Yeah. First pitch of the A-B now. Into the windup. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Well hit to right, but a foul ball, and the count holds it 0-2. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Here's Robbie Grossman. He'll start us out here in the home half of the second. First pitch on the way. Robbie. Hey, when you're featuring a mid-90s fastball like this pitcher, attack with that pitch. Get ahead. Get the offense on yep, their toes. That opens up the off-speed pitches later in the game. Grounder hit hard down the first baseline. A dive, but it's off his glove. Throws in time, and that's out number one. So one that down, no good. one aboard. The and one of the more man. prolific RBI okay. men in the league the I'll last few you. years, Jose Abreu, will bat next. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Skied into straightaway right. Garcia has a read on it. Two down. Next to stand that in is Nico Goodrum. He'll try to make something happen Nico. with two gone in the bottom of the second. Good draw. First pitch on its way. Ball, that's out. Into his windup. Here comes the 1 0. Liner toward right center. Kane able to track it down for the third out. in the box Omar Narvaez seven eight nine bottom of the order set the to go here in the third now the pitch hey. and they start him out away with a cold strike I love everything this pitcher's got working right now he's got presence he's got great body language on the mound he's got fastball command and a nice early feel for his off-speed stuff one ball who jumped strikes. the gun a bit on that swing and he's down one and two Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. Oh, man, that's a frustrating one as a hitter. That pitcher missed right there. He did not want to hang that breaking ball with two strikes, and you foul it away. You have to regroup. You're not seeing that again. Another one sent foul. Here he comes again, 1-2. Swing and a miss as he starts the third the same way he ended the second with a punch out, one away. The first so one out and nobody aboard. And that'll bring up Rowdy Tellez. Here's the pitch. Weak grounder down the line at third. And there's out number two. So next to bat will be Brandon Woodruff. This guy's still looking at a zero in the hit column. Woodruff. First pitch on its way. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. A little quick on that swing, and he finds himself behind 0-2.
One and two to the Brewers pitcher. Well, that's a smart miss there. Sometimes guys will chase it down there, especially when they're in protect mode on an 0 and 2 count. That's a hit, the first of the game for Milwaukee. The batter, the second baseman, Colton. Wong. Here's the second baseman, Colton Wong. As he'll take a look at ball one. And 2 0 now as this misses below the knees. Now, this is the kind of count this guy feeds on at the plate. You can bet he's geared to hit the fastball right here. Counts even at 2 and 2 to Wong. Well, that's just a nice executed pitch right there. To have the confidence to go in, pound it inside. If he's got that, this team's in trouble. Swing and a miss as he chases one out of the zone for the third strike, and that's the third out of the inning. Now to the plate, here is Victor Reyes. He'll get us going in the home half of inning number three. The right fielder, Victor Reyes. He's ready. Here's the first pitch. Hit fairly well out towards straightaway center. Kane is under it, and that's the first out of the inning. Stepping in next, Batting Crash in. Davis, as he'll dig into the left-handed batter's box. Davis. First pitch of the A.B. on its way. Snatched out of midair at first base for out number two. Batting nine. Next to hit, Spencer no Turnbull. Number 56. Ready to deliver. Here comes the first pitch. Check swing here as he couldn't help himself, and it's ruled strike two. Count remains at 0-2. Bottom of inning number three, nothing, nothing our score. A ball and two strikes now. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Swing and a miss for strike three. Pulled the string on him that time, and the inning is over. Digging in now for the Brewers. Lorenzo Kane flew out last time up. I know we're not seeing a lot of offense in this one, but there's still some game left. I'm looking to see these guys, both offenses, make some notable adjustments at the dish and try and scratch a few runs across. Throw to first in time. One gone here in the fourth. Now batting. Stepping in once again is Avisail Garcia. Here comes the pitch for Garcia. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. Still all zeros in the run column here in the fourth inning. Dan, does this continue or does somebody score here? Oh, you have to love it. You know, Matt, we have so many of these games that are 12 to 10 and 9 to 8. It's nice to see a low scoring pitcher's duel for once. This is on the ground over to first. Oh, just in time, and oh, that was awfully close. Next up is Eduardo Escobar. He's 0 for 1 thus far. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Sinker runs outside to start the at bat. 1 and 0. Breaking ball called just a bit low. Two and one now. And it's two balls and two strikes now. You could tell by the hitter's balance after that swing that he's seeing the ball really good. His timing is right there, and I expect him to catch something clean. Got him swinging. Made him chase outside the zone that time, and that puts an end to the inning. Now to the plate, Johan Moncada. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. The second baseman. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Sends that one out of play for strike one. 
There's a fastball pretty close that time, but ruled a ball one and one. Fastball close, but he didn't get it two and one. They're going to probably stay away from this guy. He's got so much power. You don't want to miss over the heart of the plate. But I think when pitchers try to be too cute on that outside corner, they might leak one a little bit inside. And this is where that guy would jump on it. Now the three and two pitch. Chopped weakly to the left. Again, another foul ball. You can definitely tell with that foul off right there that he's picking up spin on this pitcher's off-speed stuff. Maybe expect a fastball on this next one. Throw on to first in time, one away. Now one down with the bases empty. And here's the former Rule 5 pick, Akil Badu. Here's the first pitch to him. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. There's another pitch for a strike, and this guy's really attacking hitters well tonight, being aggressive early on. And if he continues to throw strikes like he is, he's going to have a pretty good night. One ball and two strikes to count. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Under it is Yelich, and there are two away now. Up next, Jose yeah, Ramirez. He flew out baseman. in his last A.B. Okay. Almost, Matty. Almost Ramirez. went deep his last A.B. Certainly just missed it. With this guy's big power, he's feeling pretty good at the dish. Look for him to try and get on something and drive it out of the yard this A.B. And that'll get down out there near the wall. And he'll coast into second here with a two-out double. The left fielder, number eight. At the plate now, Robbie Grossman. Grossman. Oh, and he hammers it to deep right field. And that one is gone! I can tell you one thing. You might get away with throwing the ball in that location in the minor leagues, but when you get one up like that in the zone right over the plate against these guys, you're going to get exactly what he got. A really bad result. Now back. Here's Jose Breyer. Okay. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. 0 for 1 for him here in this one. Line shot to second, but it's caught and the side is retired. All set for the start of the inning, and up next will be Willie Adamas. The shortstop. Really, a dime. First pitch on its way. Liner toward right center. And that's a base hit. One for two in his first couple of plate appearances. The left fielder, number 22, Christian Yelich. In is Christian Yelich. As he'll take one up in the zone, but indeed in the strike zone for the first strike. Pitcher wants to have a quick inning right here, capitalize on the momentum his batters have. And prior to the 0-2, oh, a we'll move to first. And he's back standing. Ready on 0-2. Now a ball grounded to short. This could be two. One there to Abreu for the big double play. So base is empty now, now after the double play. Yep. And next to hit is the catcher, Narvaez. Here's the first pitch to him. I really like how he's getting ahead early in the count. He's pitching aggressively, and what that does, it holds the pitch count down. And it's fouled away. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. Oh, and there's the good curveball as he set down on strikes for the second time here tonight. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and that'll bring forth the slugging shortstop, Nico Goodrum. Ready to deliver. Here comes the first pitch. Just off the outside, and it's 1-0. That swung on and missed, we're even at one and one. 
Goodrum has all the necessary skills to play great defense on the left side of the infield, and it makes him really fun to watch. He can pick it with the best of them, but what sets him apart is the huge arm. It's accurate. It's incredibly strong. Certainly has the ability to uncork a throw and beat a runner when he needs to, and it's impressive to watch. Yeah, anybody that has the ability to go to their backhand and to absolutely fire a cannon across the infield is a huge asset to have. There to haul it in is Escobar, and that's the first out. Now at the plate right now field. is Victor Reyes. Victor. Flied out in his first at right bat, so make him 0 for 1 so far. Now here's the pitch. Hey, usually the second time through the order, you start seeing an incorporation of some more off-speed stuff. But this guy's locating and feeling really good about his fastball. Two back-to-back. -back. Here comes the 0-2 pitch. Tried to stay back on the change up there, but this is chopped foul at home plate. The 0-2 once more. Nope. Love the high heater right there to raise the hitter's sights. Let's see if he buries something in the dirt right here. And a good take there. Close, but it's two and two. He started this guy backwards. Couple of off-speed pitches early, followed by back-to-back -back heaters. He can go either way he wants to go right now. Full count, three and two. There's ball four. Now with the plate is Crash. Davis comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Davis. He's set. Here it comes. Tried to check it, and it's 0 and 1. And it's quickly 0-2. Both teams with just two hits apiece thus far. Fouled off. And a fastball swung on and missed as he just reared back there. Two away. Now batting. Now to the Number plate, 56. the pitcher, Spencer Turnbull, struck out in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, but it was a good changeup, Matty. Oh, good arm action on that pitch. Look for him to try and stay back a little bit more. Let the ball get a little deeper. Don't be shocked if this pitcher tries to rush a heater right here. A ball and a strike now. Now a move over to first, and the runner back easily. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One, one. Fastball called strike. One and two. Runners off for second. Pitch outside. The throw is not close as he's in there with a stolen base. Here now the 2-2. Two, two. Hit high in the air down the right field line. And that's going to fall for a base hit. Throw into second. The tag, and they'll get him at second. And with that, the side is retired. Leading off for the Brewers, the first baseman, number 11. Rowdy Tellez the next to bat. As he takes a cold strike at the knees, it's 0-1. He's 0-for-1 after grounding out in his only trip to the plate so far. In front of the changeup, and he can't keep it fair. Two strikes on him now. Line to the right side. But this will wind up foul. Still 0-2. Into the windup and the pitch. Fouled away. The next 0-2 is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Tyrone Taylor steps into the on-deck circle now, looking to start something here with one gun in the inning. Taylor. First offering. Oh, that's just out. The 1 0 home. No runs, two hits, and no errors on the Milwaukee line score so far. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike.
three and two now. Well, you don't see it all that often, but this might be a good time for a 3-2 change. If he can locate it, it's nearly impossible to hit. And he lays off. Ball four. So he comes right off the bench and works the walk. Usually easier said than done. And prior to the first pitch, you look to first. Don't want to forget about him. Comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Colton Wong is next as he finds himself behind 0 and 1. A 1 and 1 count to the Brewers' leadoff man. Well, these guys haven't had too many opportunities yet to test the running game in this one, so they could decide to put a man in motion right here. The 1 and 2 pitch. Snap throw from the catcher, but he gets dirty and gets back to the bag. He's set. Here's the 2 2. Rolled slowly down the first baseline. Looked like he was cheating a heater right there. A little bit too far out in front. Got to find a way to keep his hands back. A bouncer up the middle. Fielded cleanly. There's Moncada. On the first, it's a double play. As their woes continue, the inning is over. Ladies Daniel Norris enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Now pitching for Milwaukee. Number 32. Daniel. Bottom of the inning now. And standing in is the power hitting second baseman, Johan Moncada. Leading off for Cooperstown. The second baseman, Johan. Here's the first pitch. Moncada. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. Hit on the ground toward the left. Scooped up. Throw to first is in time for the first out. Striding in is Akil Badu. No hits to this point. Badu. Curry Puckett will come on as a pinch hitter to try and make an impact with one away. Wheels and deals. Here's the first pitch. Now here's a swing and a fly ball out to center for the new man just inserted into the ball game. And that'll take care of the pinch hitter here for route number two. Now, now the bat, bat Jose Ramirez. Ramirez. He doubled okay. earlier in the game. One for two Ramirez. to this point. He's set and the pitch. Ramirez swings, and this one's hit well to left. And that one is gone! No surprise with that swing of the bat. This guy is simply one of the best in the game right now. There's not too many guys that take a beautiful hack like that in the league. The left fielder, number eight. In Robbie. now, Robbie Grossman. Yeah. As he'll take a changeup here for strike one. A hit in two at bats for him at this point in the ballgame. Now, a fastball gets the upper part of the zone for strike two. You got to cover the whole plate now after letting him steal two strikes on the one inside ball. half. And he misses there, one and two. Hit out towards second. And that finds its way through for a base hit. Now batting. The first baseman, Jose Abreu. So here's the slugging first baseman, Jose Abreu now. Ball one to start the at-bat. The 1-0 is offered at and missed for the first strike. It's not easy to get your barrel to a pitch that high. That can be an effective location as long as he keeps it above the letters. The 1 1 home. Fly ball right down the line and left. Yelich is under it. And that's the third out.
seventh inning ready to roll. And next it'll be the outfielder, Lorenzo Cain. The center fielder, number six, Lorenzo Cain. Here's the first pitch. And he just keeps rolling along as he starts another batter out with strike one. In my opinion, one of the toughest pitches in the game to square up. Just a heavy sinker with good downward action. In there, one and two now. Bottom dropped out on him, and that's a strikeout. He'll throw down to first, one away. So here is Abisayo Garcia. 0 for 2 from him so far in this one. First pitch coming. Here it is. And a called strike down in the zone. Nothing in one. I really like how he's been attacking hitters early in these oh, ABs. Cool. He's thrown strikes on the first pitch to over 70% of the guys he's faced so far. Popped him up. Goodrum over to his left. Two down. So here's Eduardo oh, Escobar. Escobar. He's 0 for 2 in the ball Number game eight. so far. Eduardo Escobar. First delivery to him. Aye. 0 and 1. Here it comes. Boy, he's been great in this one. He's only one strike away from putting another zero on the scoreboard. And that's into the corner of foul ball and right. And he fouls this one off. Here comes another 0 2. Two out, nobody on. And he's got himself another one as he picks up strikeout number nine here, and the side is retired. So stepping in is Nico Goodrum. He'll start things out here in the bottom of inning number seven. Nico Goodrum. And now the first pitch. Line drive to center field. And that'll get down for a base hit. So he goes after the first pitch, and it's early trouble here this half of the inning. Now batting, right fielder, Victor Reyes. Standing in now, Victor Reyes. Drilled down the line. And this gets past him at third as it hugs the line. A fair ball. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. Aaron Ashby comes on now, now in an awfully it. difficult Catcher. situation Brad. as there are two on here Davis. with nobody out. Your attention, please. Now pitching for the Brewers, number 22. Stepping Aaron. in now, Crash Ashby. Davis. He swings and sends it in the air to right center field. In there, a base hit. He's in at second safely. As a run will score on the play as well. The batter, number 56. Now time called at the plate as he'll step out and try and start it again. Byron Buxton will Your come on to pinch please. hit here, and if they don't pinch walk hitting. him, he'll have a great Fire RBI man. opportunity with runners Buxton. at second and third and nobody out. And now the first pitch. High in the air out to center field. Kane is under it. And he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. And they decide not to push things here with one away as he'll hold on at third base. Now back. Second so the baseman. lineup flips over and Yo digging on. in. Yoan Moncada. He Moncada. bounced out last time up. Here's the first pitch to him. And he waves at a curveball there. No balls and a strike. Hey, if he's going to execute that curveball, and that's the first one of the day, if he's going to execute it like that, be on the lookout for that one. As he arrives at second without a play, has two runs come across to score away from the play. 
Puck Kirby hit. Puckett digging in now. High in the air down the right field line. Garcia has a read on it. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. Next to dig in, Jose Ramirez, runner in scoring position with two gone. In the last at bat, that breaking ball was really up in the zone. Not a good spot for a pitcher to throw the off speed pitch. If he wants to come back and throw that in this at bat, he. And we'll just leave it there as they make the play to end the inning. Brian Garcia has been summoned from the now bullpen pitching. as he'll do so to start Boy, the eighth. Garcia. Ready to begin the eighth and stepping up as the shortstop, the Willie group. Adamas. The shortstop, Willie Adamas. Now here's the first offering. Comes set and the 0 1. High and deep to left center field. Racing back the center fielder. Gone to lead off the inning. What a great feeling right there as he circles the pillows. Finally able to get this offense potentially going with one swing of the bat. Being shut out all game, but not anymore. The left field, number 22. And here's Christian Yelich now. And on the first pitch, he grounds foul. The 0-1 delivery. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0-2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. I got the count. Well, that's a pitch right there. You gotta just lay off. There's a good chance he's gonna throw it on 0-2. And, and if you can recognize it starting down in the zone, you know it's only gonna go down from there. And a good throw gets him one gun. Now the plate here is Narvaez. One run in and one gun so far in this inning. From the stretch. And he starts him out with a strike on the outer half. Behind 0 and 2 now. Pitch on the way. This is hit the other way out toward left field. Grossman is going to get there as he backs up to put it away. And there are two gone now. So two gone now in the Brewers half of the eighth. And that'll bring up Rowdy Tellez. Here's the first pitch. Hit on the ground out to short. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Robbie Grossman. He's two for three and looking for more here. Robbie Grossman. Now here's the pitch. Driven deep at the wall. It is gone. Second home run of the game right there. He is locked in at the plate. You hear so many of today's players talk about rhythm and timing. Well, he is perfectly on time in the heart of the zone. Into the box, now Jose Abreu, and it's fouled away. Abreu. He's hitless in three at bats to this point. A ball and a strike now to Jose Abreu. Popped up. Tellez shading to his right, and he hauls it in for the first out of the inning. Now it'll be now Nico Goodrum. Not shortstop. Nico. Good draw. Here's the first pitch to him. This is flared out towards second. Throw on to first, two gone. Next to hit is Victor Reyes. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. And now the first pitch. Hard line. 
liner, but picked up on a hop. Throw in oh. time, and the side is retired. Gregory Soto takes the ball now in inning number nine, looking to close the door. Luis Urias is going to pinch hit here to lead off the ninth, and with his club already well down, he'll just need to try and get on base here. First pitch coming, here it is. Into the windup. Here comes the 0 2 pitch. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Up next from the off. Fulton Wong will stand in. He could really use a knock Colton. here. 0 for 3 in the game so far. First pitch is a slider down low. It's 1 0. And he gets a piece here as this ball is fouled away. The one one is in there for the second strike. Hit hard toward the right side. A leaping try but it's out of his reach and into the outfield. Not in time and he's in there with a double. The center fielder number six. Lorenzo And in to hit next is Lorenzo Cain as the sinker to him finds the zone for strike one. That's in there and he's deep in the hole now 0 and 2. Don't expect too many more high fastballs in this one. He is known for his sinker keeping the ball on the ground. But taken in over at first for the second out as that might have been extra bases if it were three feet higher. As a look, now the pitch. Avisail Garcia is in with two away now as he looks at a called strike one. Taken called strike two, and now they're down to their final strike tonight. Boy, you can see he's coming right at this guy, just pounding the ball in the strike zone. Milwaukee, good night. This one was pretty evenly matched coming in. Two spring training teams, but someone's got to win. Either way, both of these teams will look to move up the ranks and continue building a formidable squad. Eight to one is the final tonight. The Legends took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Spencer Turnbull is the winning pitcher of record. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to the new website, theshow.com. Here now is our final line score. First for your victorious home team. Eight runs, ten hits, no errors. They left three men on base. For the Brewers, one run, four hits, no errors. They left three men on base. Time of the ball game, three hours and 16 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight. And we remind you to please Drive home safely.